lovely. Welcome back to my channel today. I have some no, no. Uh, products that I want to share with you. The first one is the eyeshadow palette from Beach Cosmetics. It's absolutely a stunner and I'm blown away by the color schemes and also the blendability of it and I can't wait to share with you and also some of the products that I didn't think that I would like but I actually changed my mind after this time and I really like them so um, uh, before we go in get started I, I would like to enjoy uh, my channel because in here you can see a lot of things about makeup and the different uh, capital of makeup for example the high-end and also the drugstore and for oily skin which is me and also some makeup haul that all right the eyeshadow today I'm using is from BH cosmetics it's called opal lessened I have used this eyeshadow one time and I have very good impression about it and that's how what the pan looks like they have a very beautiful neutral side and also very light uh, color scheme shimmer side so let's try put some eyeshadow on the eyelid I'm gonna use this shadow it's a little bit uh, brownish neutral color very easy to blind it's very very easy to blind I hardly put any shadow on it on my outer corner actually.
telescope. I no idea. Well, uh, this mascara is very good at separating the lashes, so that's my main purpose, just to uh, separate them all. I no idea. So that's my eye with the lashes. Yeah. Um. So. About this eyeshadow, it does have a little bit of fallout, yeah, and it does not much at all. And I can definitely um, recommend if you, um, after some type of, um, you know, the, the gentle shade scheme, and it's a good fit. And now I think uh, we can go back to the face. No doubt, my Elf um, Pore Lace Primer. So basically this primer gives me very smooth canvas and it is very affordable and um, and it's a large jar. You can use it for a really long time and uh, so if you are after some type of a smoothing primer, uh, if you are like me, have large pores, I definitely recommend for my um, CoverGirl True Blend uh, Matte Made Foundation. Uh, this is my very trustworthy uh, matte foundation that I like to use when I want a you know matte uh, complexion. This is a foundation that I can trust, but uh, it is very thick, yeah. So you wouldn't need much. I just had one pump, and it would, wouldn't even. I wouldn't even finish this one pump for the full face. I don't want a full coverage today, so I'm just gonna go for a natural, um, you know, my skin is my skin type of uh, foundation. I'm happy with this already. Although it didn't cover some of my um, blemish. Um, and like I said, this one doesn't give you the full, full coverage, but it does last. Uh, really well on my skin and my skin at the end of the day will look nice but it's not a full coverage foundation uh, the blemish, blemish cannot be covered the slash blush that contours my nose this one is from the balm the color is called let's see balm desert that's a very cool toned um, Browns out, and I like it to contour my nose. In audio. In audio. My hula bronzer. I think I find the heat pen. happy with my bronzes, bronze skin, I'm now going for my blush. Today I want to try uh, my Profusion blush number 3. Uh, Profusion is a very affordable uh, American brand that um, they have a good eyeshadow palette and this blush, uh, I have to say I tried it before, it is quite, um, it does have a lot of shimmers um, and um, but the cover is very beautiful. So. I'm looking at the mirror. Uh, I didn't see shimmer this time. I am very uh, shocked because before when I used three times, it's all kind of, um, you know, very shimmery. But this time, oh, I see. This time on this side, I do see a little bit of um, shimmer, but not as heavy. I think it's because I have shake it off. 
on my chairs many many times that's why it's not that shimmery and the color is quite beautiful I just need a little bit more I'll shake it off Now I'm happy with my blush. Um, oh, yeah. I want to emphasize some of the eyeshadow. I really like this. Oh, that's their highlight palette. Um, oh, yeah. yeah. the lip I um, don't have so much new product In that audio. I want to show you so I'll just skip it okay, so this is the finished look and I think it is a very effortless and uh, it's a very nice and subtle uh, in general speaking um, very beautiful makeup and uh, I really like it so now let's go through the products oh my god guys this Beach Cosmetics uh, Opalescent Eye Shadow is amazing. It is so easy to blind and it gives you the most gorgeous, um, effortless look. And so basically, this, this will be the eye palette that I'm gonna put um, on my top drawer. Um, or I use it whenever I don't know what to use. So definitely, um, if you purchase this, you won't be disappointed. Uh, all the shimmers that I tried, one, two, uh, I think I tried this one as well. They are very beaming. And um, I want to give you a close up. And also, uh, the deeper matte color, this one, and this one, gorgeous. Very pigmented. I really enjoy this eye palette. And also, something that I didn't like, and this time I used, I changed my mind, is this product is from Profusion Blush 3. This blush, uh, after this time, I didn't notice the shimmer amount is out of my acceptance. I really like how my complexion, especially my cheek area, I really like how it looks and uh, it's very pigmented. Um, you know, I like a very pigmented blush and it can build up, no problem. Love Beauty Creation Cali Glow. I'm not sure about this. Uh, I don't know. It, I do see my highlight, but uh, it didn't blow my mind as the other sort. That's it for the day. So, thank you for watching. Please subscribe my channel, and I'll see you next time.